So the Syrian Dinner Project started up by one of our team and a group of the Syrian women who had an interest in catering. Oh, we are three ladies uh, from uh, Syria. Uh, love to cook. We started the uh, events for uh, give uh, money for uh, uh, trips for uh, m uh, families and uh, make a uh, uh, first event and after that make uh, more 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 events. Our project uh, unites us. We we cook with, with love, sharing food uh, for the community. It then developed because it was received so well by the local community. So it developed into a social enterprise. In this pandemic period, they've been doing takeaways and it's just been an incredibly good boost to the women's self-esteem and their sense of confidence and their sense of belonging. So one of the women said to me recently that she felt like she'd been born here and she felt this community was incredibly welcoming. And yeah, it's been a great collaborative initiative. It was just so uh, intimate and casual and carefree because I think in concerts like these bring out a side of them that maybe doesn't have the chance to come out during daily life. So to, to actually show another side of those people, they're not just shy people trying to figure their, their way out here. They have culture, they, they have so much joy to live and bring out and share with others. The children uh, had fun. See family have been making food for tonight. Food was a really good idea because the Syrian families are inviting us to their home, albeit you know they've had to make a new home. But we are their guests for tonight. We are their guests, and I think that's a that's a great, great idea and a great thing to do.